Welcome back. As all systems go for Mozambique's general elections next week, these will be Maputa's seventh polls since the advent of a multi-party democracy in 1994. The ruling Frelimo's party is expected to face a stiff challenge from Venetio Mondlane, who is running as an independent candidate. As Mozambique seeks to consolidate its democracy, the country will vote on the 9th of October in presidential and legislative elections. Authorities say they have put measures in place to ensure that the polls proceed without any glitches. Outside of the country, there will be voting stations, seven in the African continent and two in Europe. Some of the dominant issues ahead of the polls include economic hardships, uh, climate change and security challenges in the country's northernmost province of Cabo Delgado. The Mozambican Electoral Commission has embarked on different campaigns in South Africa to ensure that Mozambican nationals who are based here go out in their numbers to vote. The commission is training their polling staff from Limpopo and Mpumalanga in Mbombela. Gearing up for general elections in Mozambique. In a couple of days, Mozambican nationals will be heading to the polls. These officials are training in preparation for the elections taking place in Mozambique next week. A number of Mozambican nationals in the country have shown interest to vote. Um, 64,200 um, registered voters to vote in uh, 111 polling stations. The commission says they've registered a number of concerns and challenges on the ground as they are training the polling staff. The major, the major challenge is that you have a distance. Uh, people come from far away. As for registration, we have this mobile uh, registration posts. So people have been registered far away, which means that on the voting day they have to come to the polling station, which is a fixed one. So that's a, a, a big challenge. And uh, of course the resources. We don't have uh, uh, many resources uh, to um, uh, probably provide the people with transport that would be uh, much helpful. So uh, those are the major challenges. The other challenge is that uh, um, people are operating in different languages. We have people who speak English, people who speak uh, Shangana, and people who speak uh, Portuguese. Some Mozambican nationals in parts of Mpumalanga have mixed feelings about taking part in the upcoming elections. She says, I will go and vote in the upcoming elections. I will be voting for Ferlimo so that we can see change in our country in Mozambique. We are here in Mpumalanga because of poverty. Our children have studied but they do not have jobs. I will not be voting as I don't see any reason why I should vote. Mozambique is full of criminal activities. Mozambican nationals who are in the country have been urged to go out in their numbers to vote next week Wednesday. The voting stations will open from 7 a.m. until 6 p.m. Nhlamulo Mabasa, SABC News, Mbombela.